Hi everyone, we are talking brows today, specifically we are talking MAC brows and uh, MAC have just released their Brows Are It collection uh, which is now part of their permanent collection and they've released a whole bunch of different products and I've got a few of them here today to show you. So MAC have always done brows, you will recognize these products, these are the very very thin uh, brow pencils, I've got the shade um, spiked and brunette here. Let's see if we can focus. And um, these are fantastic. Um, many of us have already used these and are um, very happy with these. But um, they have really, I won't say jumped on the bandwagon because they've always done great brows, but they really have listen to what consumers are saying and have really expanded on their products. And I have to say my favorite of all the new um, releases is this baby. And this is a um, jumbo kind of eye crayon, um, eyebrow crayon I should say, and it's called the Big Brow Pencil. And if you compare this to the original, you can see obviously there's a big difference. And um, I'll see if I can get this lid off for you. <laughs> Um, so what you have, and this is a little grotty because I've been using it like crazy, I'm loving it. Um, what you have here in exactly the same shade as the eye pencil is a thick crayon. It's very, very waxy and it gives a really great um, natural look to the brows. And the way that you are supposed to use this and the way I've been using it is you actually um, brush it through your brows backwards um, and then comb your brows in the normal way that you would. So this is spiked um, and it is, like I said, it's quite sheer or quite um, natural and quite waxy and it's not really intense. So um, that in my opinion is a great thing if you are going for that really natural um, big brow. Um, this is fantastic both for women and men uh, because it isn't that really sharp, like I said, um, you know, defined brow. And if you compare that again to the original and spiked, it's different. You see it's um, spiked is a lot more um, defined and it's a lot more pigmented in the way that it goes on. So that's going to give you a really natural looking brow. So what you could do if you do like the defined is you could go ahead and um, push that into the brows backwards against the against the grain of the hairs I suppose you could say and then go ahead and define your outer edges with that if you do like a little bit more of a defined brow. The next product is, um, this is the brow set. Now this is the clear one, but there are a whole bunch of different shades available. Now this one again is just clear and it's going to just set the brows, but um, the others are going to provide a little bit of coverage as well. Um, next is the brow liner. And um, I haven't used this one because this is a little dark for me, but this is in the shade Velvet Stone, which is quite dark. And like a lot of brow pencils on the market, you do get a spoolie on one end, which I'm not sure if it's just my one or if that's the design. It's slightly bent. Um, it would make sense that that's the way that it's made, but I don't know. Um, and you just get a standard brow pencil. Um, this one, again, is too dark for me, so I can't use it. But I do like that it's not as um, soft and pigmented as some of the others. Um, so you can get a really um, sharp look and it's going to stay put. Okay. Um, so that's that. And what's next? Um, this one is one I'm quite excited about. So they've now got brow powder duos. And um, why I love these is because, um, sure, there's some great shades available. I have it in the shade Redhead. But this lighter, um, this darker brown, I should say, sorry, is actually perfect for me when I'm going for a lighter look. Um, and they are really nice um, shadows. And the, again, the reason why I do like these is because you can take these with you on the road and actually use them as eyeshadows. So they're essentially the same thing. People have been using MAC eyeshadows as brow powders forever. So um, they're now available. Um, and I do believe... In, I don't know if, I, yeah, I'm pretty sure I, that in the pro store you can actually get more shades like in a bigger pan. But um, to us available is the um, duos. 
And then the last thing I can share with you is um, the, uh, what is it called? Fluid Line Brow Gel Cream. So this is um, not quite a pomade. Um, again, I haven't used this one personally because it is the wrong shade for me. This is Dirty Blonde. But when I played with some of the shades um, in store, they are really, really smooth. And I am going to assume that this is very, very similar to their Fluid Line um, Gel Liner formula. Um, but it does, it did go on really, really smoothly, give a really nice finish and, um, yeah, just looked really, really nice. Um, so that's pretty much that from the collection that I own. There are some other bits and pieces that have been released. Um, let me know what you think. Um, is there anything you think they've missed? Have a look on the website, on my website, and have a look at um, some more information, some links of how to buy these products. And also have a look on the MAC website because there's a whole bunch of other bits and pieces that are available in this line. But I thought I'd just give you a little introduction let you know about my new uh, favorite. This will be featuring in my next favorites, uh, monthly favorites, because I have been using it almost every single day. And um, just let you see what's up. So um, yeah, leave a comment and like below and let me know what you think. And I'll see you next time. Bye.